Madam Speaker, as we have done in previous years, in preparing this budget, the government engaged stakeholders in the tourism industry to discuss the concerns and to receive proposals from them. One of the proposals submitted by the Dominica Hotel and Tourism Association, DHT, for inclusion in the 2016-2007 budget is the establishment of a special loan facility to finance the upgrading and expansion of existing hotels and restaurants. The DHT identified that the need for low-cost financing as one of the most critical matters for its members. The above request, Madam Speaker, is consistent with the policy of the government to increase the number of high-quality high rooms in Dominica. As such, government has given positive consideration to the request and will put in place a loan facility at the aid bank for the purpose of financing the upgrade and expansion of existing hotels and restaurants in Dominica. An amount of $15 million from the proceeds of the Citizenship by Investment Program will be deposited in the aid bank for unlending to the hotel sector. The government has also decided, based on consultations with the hoteliers, to set the interest rate at 3% and with a grace period of one year, Madam Speaker, 12 months. I challenge Madam Speaker, in the listening or the hearing of my voice, if there are better interest rates in any bank in Dominica, in the, in the Caribbean, we will match those interest rates to the, to the one existing. Bank. Anyway, Madam Speaker, in the Caribbean, the relevant agreement with the aid bank has been prepared and will be signed again, Madam Speaker, immediately upon the passage of the budget by the Parliament. <laughs>